On this day, 99 years ago, the 19th Amendment was adopted, giving women the right to vote. Since then, August 26th has been recognized as Women's Equality Day. This afternoon, Demetrius Sanders spent some time at a Women's Equality March in Terre Haute. He joins us with why those in attendance say this day is so important. Demetrius. Mike Sadie, since 2012, the Vigo County League of Women Voters have hosted a march to honor Women's Equality Day. And this afternoon, that tradition continued. Monday's wet weather didn't stop dozens of Valley community members from marching through ISU's campus. It is part of the 8th annual Women's Equality March hosted by the Vigo County League of Women's Voters. I want women to feel like, you know, whatever a man can do, I can do too. It's very important to, you know, show that mentality of, yes, we can. During the event, community members had the chance to listen to several inspirational speakers, create signs, and of course, march. Some participants of the march say seeing people of different backgrounds support a cause is what makes this type of event so special. I think this demonstration is a lot more powerful when you have um, people from all different backgrounds at it rather than simply just um, the women. Leaders of the march say they hope to not only recognize the 99th anniversary of women's suffrage, but also stress the importance of voting as a whole. People need to understand that their vote is also their voice. And in order for democracy to continue, we need to uh, be engaged. And although much progress has been made since 1920, Calicott says the fight for women's voting rights must still continue. We also have obstacles coming in today with uh, different uh, rules that need to be met in order to register to vote. But uh, we'll keep fighting on. Children in the home and in the school and to help in framing statutes and determine who shall rule. During the march, the League of Women Voters also distributed replicas of a $20 bill featuring Harriet Tubman to honor her being chosen as a new face for the bill. Mike. All right, thank you, Demetrius.